Yeah, so isn't this a great it's location? It's beautiful. I remember when they first started the garden here, they, uh, I wasn't here on that day, but I saw these photographs and they brought in the oxen from um, New Ross Farm. Okay. So they had a team of oxen come and turn the soil. Wow. And in amazing photographs of this you know, beautiful blue sky and this really nice green hillside and these two big oxen. <laughs> So this is um, a community garden that anybody can take from, or yeah, is it specifically? Um, this is part of Common Roots. Mm. So Common Roots used to be down by the wall tree in Halifax, mm -hmm. and then they, re they relocated because they lost that site, and uh, so they moved part of their garden somewhere else in Halifax, but then they also turned this into a community garden. So this part of it here, Oh, so them. this is n new here then? Yeah, not because last few years. Yeah, yeah because last yeah. year was the first year I noticed it wasn't there mm -hmm. in Halifax. Yeah. yeah, there was a bit of a community garden here before. I think it was a project of the hospital, mm. uh, but then Common Roots has gotten very involved, and uh, during the summer they've had staff here, mm -hmm. and people working. So uh, all of the boxed beds here are allotments that people can sign up for. Mm -hmm. I think it's like 35 or $40 to get one. That's nice. And then you're responsible for that. And on this side here, these are all gardens that are maintained by uh, the staff who are working here and also residents and staff of the hospital. Mm -hmm. So it's kind of a program of um, the health authority or the hospital. And they sell these. They have a weekly market, kind of, I think, in the parking lot. So they use it to raise money for the whole program. That's but great. then all these little round beds that are along the walkway here are uh, for anybody. So huh. like that's a currant bush that I harvested from a while oh, ago. How are you kidding? These sunflowers, rose hips, chives. Wow. Yeah. See, there's blueberries. Yeah. It doesn't look like. Oh, there's one left. <laughs> On the blueberry. Like no, you go ahead. <laughs> There might be another one somewhere. Mmm, <laughs> delicious. Yeah, and some herbs, like borage. Mm -hmm. Yeah, different things. And strawberries. Yeah. yeah. Lemon cucumber. Oh, that's them there. They, they do look like little lemons, don't they? Mm -hmm. Interesting. Scarlet runner beans, which I love. I used to grow them. I have some seeds for some somewhere. Uh, tomatoes. Yeah. Lavender. Oh, nice. Yeah, I took some. Um... Oh, are those tomatillos over here? No, maybe not. Uh, oh, maybe they maybe are. Ground, or ground cherries? Um, I don't know. Yeah, I think these are ground cherries. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. There's another one there. I've never grown them. Mmm, delicious. Very nice. Mmm. Wow. Good, eh? Very good. Yeah. Well, I think this might be one of the kind of uh, hard to plant. Yeah. Black currants, yeah. That's mm -hmm. one of the ones. There's some of those down there somewhere. That's yeah, really nice here. Yeah. yeah. So, maybe we all do you want to go on the trail a little bit and then sure. kind of circle back up or something? Yeah. Okay. Look at this. Oh, yeah. It looks like a... That's, it looks like a, something from Sesame Street. Yeah, I was going to say like a fuzzy pillow yeah. or something. Oops, that's really odd. Lots of people have come sunglasses. Yeah. Yeah, I've been seeing them all over um, our area too, our neighborhood. Yeah. 
fun for kids to mm -hmm. do this year. Which way? Uh, I do before. You, can you can cut there, yeah. Do you want another one of these? Mm hmm. Like they grow really readily. Watch for them for next year. Mm. So good. Mm -hmm. Oh, look how these zinnias. I've got their slugs or cutworms or something about all my zinnias. Mm. Or almost all of them. Not chicken. Yeah. <laughs> Butter tofu. Yeah, I've never made it with tofu. Yeah. Sounds good. Oh, look at that. Is it a bee? No. Oh. It's just uh, a dead... I think it's dead. Yeah, it looks, looks pretty immobile. <laughs> but it's uh, big. Yeah. And it looks like it's an arachnid, but yeah. it also looks like a beetle. Yeah. I don't know. Um, I have other friends who are vegetarian who make butter chicken sometimes with paneer. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Which is fine if you're not vegan. Yeah. 